Hi guys, welcome back. Today we are doing a very cool video. I actually just finished watching Halloween Ends. Um, I have mixed feelings on it. Um, we're going to be talking about it here shortly, but I, I had mixed feelings. Before and before I start actually talking about the film, I do want to go ahead and put up a spoiler warning because I will be talking about, um, you know, actually what happened in the movie and stuff. So um, if you guys don't want to hear that, go ahead and leave or um, I'll see you in the next video or something like that. Uh, so let's get straight into the video. So um, in the beginning, you as you guys know, uh, if you saw the film, um, the beginning was good. Um, I liked, um, if you guys remember, the kid that fell off of the very top of the, um, the stairs. He, um, that was a really cool kill, um, because I, it was kind of unexpected for me. I didn't think he was just gonna come all the way down and die like that, but, I mean, I knew something was coming because I figured Corey was gonna start, you know, killing, and he was there, and he was getting violent, um, but, um... I liked it, and, um, it was unexpected, but, um, uh, you know, it was unexpected, but it was expected, um, but I thought the beginning was good, it was a good start, and then, um, as we go on, um, I noticed, like, 45 minutes in, uh, Michael didn't really show up, I wouldn't say that long, but, I mean, he didn't show up for a long time, um, it was really Corey, kind of, a Corey story, if that, <laughs> that rhymes, a Corey story, um, and Allison, uh, Allison, uh, she's cool, but, I mean, we're watching a Halloween movie, and, uh, I don't know, um, uh, anyway, but Michael doesn't really show up until a bit later, whenever, um, Corey goes into the sewer, um, and even then, he doesn't kill anybody until the end. Because the people, which we'll get into it later, but the people who, the Michael who was killing, you know, the people during the, early in the film was Corey. So I just didn't feel like there was enough Michael, um, unless you consider Corey Michael, which um, I'm going to go ahead and say, I, I don't, I don't like Corey. Uh, I, he's cool, but... I'd rather see Michael. And what I didn't like is Michael, he seemed like he, he was an old man, which he is an old man, but like, he was like struggling of like, he, he, he couldn't get up and like, that's not the Michael we know, you know? Like, no matter what, he, he gets up fast and, um, you know, just, he's a beast, right? Especially... Whenever James G. Courtney, you know, 2018 Halloween Kills, he was a beast. And in this, he just kind of seemed, like, broken down. Um, I wouldn't say crippled, because uh, I don't think that's the right word for it, but he was just an old man. Like, he acted like an old man, and I didn't I didn't enjoy it. That part, I, I, I didn't really like it. Um, the sewer part was pretty cool, that he was kind of hanging out in the sewers. Um... Let's go ahead and move on to my uh, third kind of feeling about it. I don't like that Corey and Michael are kind of teaming up. Because I... I I don't... Because you don't just see... In your mind, you don't just see Michael Myers teaming up with, like, some teenage boy or something like that. Um, it, I, I don't get it. No matter if he's a killer or not, Michael kills everybody. I don't... I don't... I don't understand that. And I even though Corey... Is he's pretty brutal, um, but I don't, I don't, I don't like it. And you know, whenever you know, Corey was bringing people to Michael. See, yeah, no, I, I don't like it. <laughs> I, I don't. Some people might be fine with it, but I can't. I, I, mm -mm. I was expecting maybe Michael to kill Corey or something, but no, nope, didn't happen. Um, so didn't like that part. Um, uh, Corey did have s some of the best kills, um, because Michael didn't really do much killing until the end, and even that, he didn't really kill anybody. 
fact, I don't think he did. Um, but Corey, you know, in, like whenever he cut off the tongue and blow, threw a blowtorch in his mouth, that was freaking brutal. It was pretty. That was a pretty cool kill. Uh, probably the coolest one in the whole movie, for that uh, matter. But you know, um, even the one where he runs over the runs over the girl with the car and all that—that's pretty cool stuff. Um, I think the blowtorch is brutal, though. That was that was definitely the best kill I think that was in the movie for me. Um, now, <sighs> um, I don't like. You can't just go and take Michael's map. Well, it's happened before, but he, he he doesn't just let him get away with it. You know, like he just, he's out. He wasn't even going that fast. He was crawling. So Michael, the fact that he was struggling to get up, just, it's, it's just sad. Um, it's just sad. Uh, I, I don't, I. He, Corey, I'm not going to say he's a bad Michael Myers. He's just not Michael. You know what I'm saying? He's not Michael Myers. Michael Myers is Michael Myers. Corey is Corey, who happened to dress up as Michael Myers and kill people, which, you know, it's all right. But like I said, Corey had really good kills. Like, they were brutal, and they were something Michael would do and stuff. But I, it's... I don't like having a new Michael Myers because it's been that the story is Michael Myers story. It's Halloween Michael Myers, not Corey on October 30th. It's just, I don't like Corey as Michael Myers. Let's just, let's just leave it at that. And the kills were cool and everything, but I just, I wasn't a big fan. Um, and towards the end, you know, Lori almost commits suicide and kills herself. But I thought she was going to do it. I thought she was going to, um, you know, I thought she was going to do it. Um, and then she doesn't. And it, it happens to be the pumpkin that she shoots. And then um, she, and then Michael appears or Corey appears and she shoots him and then he falls down and he is still alive um and then you know uh he like no one had no one can have her if i can't have her no one can have her so he kills himself which that doesn't make sense because if he can't if he's the bad guy here if i can't have her no one can have her how is no one going to have her if he's gone? That part didn't make much sense to me either. I might just... That might just be something that, like, my brain's just not clicking on. But that didn't make sense. Um, I kind of thought she, he was going to kill Lori for a second. And then I was like, he kill himself? I don't know. But that was really weird. And then, you know, then the... Um, um, Allison comes in thinks it's Lori, and then she sees the real Michael, and then she gets in a big old fight with Michael, as you know, and, you know, then Michael, she keeps, you know, eventually, Lori gets Michael on the counter, he's stuck, and then they kill Michael, um, police come, and then, Michael gets grinded up. Which was cool, like, the fact that they just threw him in there, like, he can't, there's no way that dude's gonna live that if he's all torn to pieces. But, you know, I don't, I don't know, I'm gonna miss Michael, for sure. Um, cause I don't think we could get another Halloween movie. Since, you know, the, he's dead. And if he's dead, there's no way they can bring him back. Unless they find some bizarre way to somehow bring him back. Which I 
cannot think of a way right now to do that. I, 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 how? If he, I, who knows? Um, people in the movie world are pretty smart. They could probably figure something out, but I don't think, at least not for years, we, we're probably not going to get another Halloween film. Unless for some reason Corey is still alive and happens, you know, to be Michael Myers um, again and call it like, probably still call it Halloween, I guess. <laughs> I don't, I don't know. Halloween is a Michael Myers movie or The Shape or Boogeyman. He's not, he's, he, he talks too. And he takes his mask off like five times in the movie and I, I don't know how I feel about that, but uh, the mask, I will, let's go and talk about the mask a little bit real quick. Um, this will be the last thing we're talking about. The mask is, I like, um, it looks great. It just looks freaking rotted and gross. I, it looks great. Um, yeah, I, I couldn't, I, I, the mask makes sense. I, I think they did great on it. I don't think they should have done um, anything else other than what they did. It makes sense for it to look like that and everything like that. So I thought the mask was great. Um, the suit, pretty cool. Which, if you guys um, remember whenever, uh, kind of towards the beginning, whenever uh, Corey is in the shop fixing up a car and he's in the jumpsuit, that's when I kind of, it's going to happen. He's, he's going to dress up as Michael. He's, he's going to be Michael and he's just going to kill Heath. That's why I was like, oh crap. This is this is already not good. Because he was in that blue jumpsuit. And I was like, oh gosh. This is... <laughs> this is going to suck. But, you know. I have faith. I gave it a chance. And it was a good movie. If I was to rate it from um, 1 to 10. I would rate it... Okay. Now, I didn't dislike the movie. Um, a lot of people are probably going to give it a worse rating than I'm going to give it. But, you know, I like 2018 and Kills better. But um, I'm going to give it a solid five or four and a half. We'll give it a solid four and a half. Because um, I liked it. It was, it was good. Now, although there wasn't much Michael and stuff, but I, the kills were cool. Um, at least some of them were. The story was okay. Um, they put effort... Michael's kill, I guess, it was... His death was a cool death. So, you gotta give him that. For, like, freaking doing tons of stuff to kill him. That was just... That was great. But, yeah. Four and a half, I think that's a fair enough rating. Um, you guys are probably lower. But, you know, that's just me. Because, you know, I... I liked it, and um, that's all I have to say about it, and uh, I, yeah, so that's about it for this video. Uh, let me know what you guys thought. Let me go, let me know what you guys think about the movie. Um, wh what's your rating from 1 to 10? Just, you know, what did you not like? What would you have changed? Let me know um, what you think about the mask and everything, but uh, that's going to conclude everything for this video. Um, let me know what you guys would like to see next. And uh, yeah, I guess I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.